From the NBC 26 Precision Forecast Center, meteorologist Brian Nisnanski. Alrighty, we're watching an area of showers and some thunderstorms to the west of the area, knocking on the door into central Wisconsin. Now, the heavier thunderstorms this morning are going to bypass us to the south. You can see they're working through uh, lower Minnesota, through Iowa, and heading into uh, far southwestern Wisconsin. For us, it's just going to be this batch of scattered showers, and we're probably going to be dealing with scattered showers through much of the day today. A little closer look on the precision radar. Now we're zoomed down to our southwestern locations. Here's Watoma, Wild Rose area, and already possibly a few sprinkles or uh, light showers starting to enter uh, western Washera County, uh, even down towards Marquette County as well. Now soon everybody will see the rain, probably in the next couple of hours, and uh, precision cast our computer model outputting the potential for around a quarter of an inch of rain in many locations today, maybe locally higher amounts, especially the southern parts of the area uh, that could see some of those heavier showers. Currently in Green Bay, we got a temperature of 57, dew point at 53, so comfortable this morning. 56, the current temperature in Appleton, it's 54 in Clintonville, 55 in Kewanee, 55 in Sturgeon Bay, 63 in Fargo, 68 in Sioux Falls, 70 too, in Kansas City, so relatively warmer to our west. We'll start to see some of those uh, warmer conditions move in here for tomorrow. Uh, 68 only for the high today with lots of clouds, but back up to 79 tomorrow, and then middle 70s expected for the rest of the week, which is seasonably cool. The normal high is 79 for today. Let's go through the forecast highlights. Again, cool, cloudy, and rain will be likely for today on and off showers. Another round of thunderstorms is possible late tomorrow afternoon and into tomorrow night and then dry and cool for the rest of the week. So the Midwestern satellite and radar, again, we're watching these scattered showers uh, from the west. Now these showers are out ahead of a warm front. That warm front passes through as we head into this evening, and until that warm front clears through, we're still going to have at least a slight chance of showers overnight tonight. We start the day dry tomorrow, but then by tomorrow afternoon, area of low pressure and cold front sweeps through, and that will give us again another chance of some thunderstorms, and maybe some of those storms will be strong tomorrow afternoon. They should be on up here as we head into Wednesday morning. Your forecast for today, mostly cloudy skies, a high of 68. Showers and thunderstorms will be likely for tonight. 61, patchy fog, still a slight chance of showers and storms tonight. And here's your seven-day forecast, 79 for the high temperature on Tuesday. Uh, rain chance on Tuesday. Tomorrow will be late in the day and into the evening. 76 on Wednesday, 76 on Thursday. Another chance of showers and storms on Friday. And of course, we got Packers preseason football on Friday at Lambeau Field. So all eyes on that day. And right now, it looks like any rain on Friday will be widely scattered. Not the greatest chance. Just kind of keep that in mind if you plan on going to the game. Now there's 10 degree difference between today and tomorrow. Yes, I think the huge part is that maybe tomorrow we're going to see more sun. Today it's just going to be kind of one of those gloomy, gloomy days. You got that yeah. trifecta. It's Monday, it's <laughs> yeah. cloudy, it's rainy. It's fitting, isn't it? All right. Yeah. Okay.